This is a cowardly act. Because what? Oh, we want to go out on summer break. This is the last two days before summer break, and we want to get out of town. We want to go on vacation. We want to go out and party. Uh, not party, I won't say that. But we want to go out and do whatever. The house wants to go out and they want to campaign. So let's hurry up and do this at the last minute. And let's change it around. And let's not do the work that the people sent us here to do. But let's just throw something at Detroit. Something that ain't going to work. Number one, it's not enough money. Number two, you don't even know how much money is needed because nobody has done an audit to say how much the debt actually is. So you don't know. You're facing a problem that you don't even know what the answer is. But this is what we're subjected to because you have the majority or somebody's in the minority or they are this part of the state or they're in that part of the state. This is not what this place was meant to be. I'm ashamed to be a damn legislator today because there's so much hard work has been put here in these bills, in the Senate bills. I, 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 I'm totally ashamed. And it, it, it's not me. It's the, it's the kids. It's the parents. It's the school district. It's not going to survive with this legislation. It's not. We all know that. Everybody in this room knows that. Nobody's going to stand up and say, this is going to get it. And I'll tell you what, 10 years from now, I'm going to call you. Hopefully, I'm still living. But I'm going to call you and say, see, told you. Mark this day, June 8, 2016, when we failed. The citizens, the students, the kids of the city of Detroit, you coward. Coward. Because we didn't stand up for what was right. We stood up for a piece of legislation that was put together and we know it's all bad legislation. We all know that. And I just can't say much more than coward. It's a cowardly act. But you come tell those kids in the city of Detroit. This is that. This is a shame. We wonder why voters don't trust us anymore. Because we don't deserve to be trusted. There's no way that I or anybody else from the city of Detroit can come to your district and tell you how to run your district and or not or do things without even your input. Because you know your district better than anybody else here. You know your neighbors. You know the people across town. You know everybody. But I'm getting decisions made about my district that I have no control over. I don't even have a say so. But you know better. Who made you God? Who made you God? Damn coward. 